So vase fillers, I feel, are a bit of a misunderstood category. They're there to fill a wide application. Not only are they there to fill the void in the vase with your floral displays or any other decoration, but they can be used in so many other ways. So yes, you can fill your vase, but you can use them in terrariums, aquariums, you can create lovely displays with candles, and a wide variety of them are used at weddings, on their tablescapes, as scatters, or any other special occasion. So today I just wanted to, without boring you with too much detail, is just go through some of the items we have in this category and show you how to use them. We've created a few little displays just to give you some ideas. So first up we've got river pebbles. So they're a nice polished pebble, they come in large sizes in black and white which are great to place on your indoor or outdoor plants. Then we've got some mini pebbles. Now up here we've created, or down here, sorry, we've created some little displays using the river pebbles, the mini ones. So we've just placed them in a nice little wooden tray, scattered them around, put a little bit of moss, and added an extra element by putting a little vase and a candle. And you've got a gorgeous little candle display. Then we've also created um, another little um, display here. In a fish bowl, we've just put some sand, and added the pebbles and it's just given a nice little look there. Now that's the river pebbles, we've also got coloured pebbles. Now they come in a few different colours, I've got some silver here, some pink and we've just created this little display here by putting two monotone colours, the black and whites, to use it as a vase filler. And of course you can be as creative as you like, you can layer different colours as we have there. So that's the pebbles. So next up we've got glass diamonds and glass gems and acrylic rocks. These are best used at weddings for the tablescapes or they use them as table scatters. Here we've just done a few little displays to show you. So these here are glass diamonds. As you can see they're a nice large size. They've got a pearlescent shimmer about them. They come in two different sizes. That's the large one. We've got a small one. You know, as we're at weddings, they do scatter them all over the table. We've just created that little display. We've also got glass gems, which can be used again as scatters, but you can put them in vases and just create a whole new look, give some color to your floral display. So our gems come again in a nice pearlescent little shimmer there. Beautiful different colors. You know, don't be afraid to mix and match your colors there. So next we've got acrylic rocks. So that's just a different option to the glass gems. They're acrylic, lightweight, they're all waterproof. You can use them in your vase. We've just placed them there in a nice little hurricane vase. And you can place a candle in there to create your little display there. So that's all our glass diamonds and rocks. We've also got some um, natural glass rocks as well. So these are um, all different broken pieces, there's no sharp edges, They're, they come in a matte finish and they come in an assortment of colours, there's the pink, white, blue and red. So again they're great for scatters and to place in your vases as well. And lastly we've got coloured sand. So colour sand is a very versatile item. They come in a few different colours. We've just created a few little displays to show you how they can be used. I find when you're using coloured sand in vases, it just brings out your floral arrangement. Instead of just placing a few stems in a vase, just by adding that extra element, just gives it a nice stylish look. Here we've created a little zen garden. We've placed it in a cylinder bowl. As you can see, the texture's a nice fine sand. We've just put some pebbles, some moss, and then here we've put a nice pink coloured sand to match our floral arrangement. And again, over here, we've just put some brown coloured sand in there. It just gives your floral arrangement that extra look. On another note about coloured sand, something that was brought to my attention, I hadn't heard about it before, maybe you guys out there have, people hold sand ceremonies. What that is, is it's designed to bring two families or two people together by combining two different grains of sand. So you'll pour two different sands in a glass vase or a jar and it's just another 
meaningful and memorable way of remembering your wedding ceremony. Apparently they're quite popular. So that's our vase fillers. I hope I haven't bored you too much and given you some ideas on how to use them. I, we do have a Kosh blog, I have mentioned in a previous video, um, an article on all our vase fillers. It goes through in detail about all of them. I've only just shown you a few. And if you're looking for these online, they'll be under the vases section. So I'd put on our little DIY hat and get creative. And don't be afraid to mix and match different textures. You can use sand with pebbles or acrylic rocks. It's really up to you.